back, my friends. My name is Eric. This is Mellow7 Gaming, and we are going to continue on with the third part in our Baldur's Gate 3 first look. We are playing the early access on Hotfix 2. Let's see what we got going on. Restoring your party. Arresting your party. Use campfire button, long rest, restoring HP and resources. Oh, wait. So let's go here. Um, our new spell is Hex. Uh, curse a creature, deal additional 1d6. Necrotic, uh, whenever you... It with an attack also has disadvantage on ability checks for one. Okay. Um, Eldritch invocations. So they gave us agonizing blast. When you cast your Eldritch blast, add your charisma modifier. Oh, I like that. Um, Thief of five fates. Once per long rest, you can cast Bane. Okay. Armor of shadows. I'm kind of thinking at the moment. Mage armor on your safe at well with all. Oh, yes. Devil sight. See normally in darkness. That's really good too. Disguise self at will. She had disguise self as well. Um, repelling blast, you push it away. No, I, I think I'm gonna go armor of shadows. I think that's gonna be really useful. I would really like the devil sight too, cause I think we're gonna want that. Um, but for now, I think that's what we go with. That's really good, actually. I'm, I'm excited about that. Um, okay, level up here. Um, prepared spells, she gets turn undead, okay? And her trickery domain gets her invoke duplicity. Summon illusion to distract your enemies, you and your, okay. Um, receive advantage uh, against a creature of both attacker and the illusion are within three. Okay, that, that actually sounds pretty cool. Um, I think we go with that. We just have to remember it's there. That's the hard part. Do you guys have anything? Nah, probably not. And we're going to do a quick F5. Um, anything up here? I don't see anything. We could potentially jump to get up there. Oh, like up there. A rapier, gold, and a silver locket. Graved with the words for Papa. Oh, well, we got to wear that, right? We put the ring on. I mean, why not? <laughs> There's our buckets of fish. <laughs> uh, I think we give one to the cleric, too. We have to share the wealth in this case. Here, I got you a present. Uh, and a rapier. Uh, we're not proficient, so it doesn't help us at all. Oh, not... So slender, but oh wait, favored by water to Havian nobility. So that's uh, okay. Water Davian, whatever it is, ranger, finesse, dippable. Um, if there's fire, you can dip your weapon into the fire, the poison, the blood, the whatever, and then attack with it, which is pretty cool. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at her really fast. Um, we know that she is. So she's a cleric of the trickery domain. Okay, melee attack plus four, spell attack is plus five, spell DC, uh, decent wisdom, reasonable strength and constitution, and charisma uh, are actions. Okay. Um, we just have to figure out... So I guess all... Okay, so these are our actions here. Well, two of them, and there's the third one. I'm going to slide that one to there and just flip those around. Um, then we've got our cantrips. Resistance. D4 bonus, okay. That could be useful. The Sacred Flame. Okay, so that's a cantrip. So we should be able to do that one a lot if I want to. So I'm not scared of using that. And Minor Illusion distracts. Oh, that could be really useful too. Okay, so these four. Well, these three and... Here, I'm going to move this. Actually, what I'm going to do... So that's a... Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put my actions here. I know this is the boring bit. Um, put my potion down there. I don't know that that needs to be on the action bar. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, it just gives us an extra space. Okay. So I can go a couple extra spaces if I want. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these two down here then. Uh, kind of the weird, the scrolls and stuff we've discovered. We'll throw down here. Okay, so I've got my actions there, and I think I can put my cantrips right after that. So we've got resistance, our guidance, our flame, and then our minor illusion. And then down here, we'll run the spells that we've got going. Got Bane. Receive D4 penalty attack rolls and saving throws. Again, I need to remember to use all my these kind of supporting type abilities. There we go. Something like that. I think that'll work okay. Here, we'll, we'll put this here so we've got some spots there. I like that. Oh, wait. So she actually looks pretty badass. I, I think that's a, a pretty cool character. Uh, I know we come here. Um, we've got R2 cantrips. I'm going to do something similar here. I'm going to go... Plus, give myself a couple extra ones. Toss these down here. What do we got? We've got some fire resistance, an alchemist fire. Okay. A void bulb. Uh, pulls all nearby unfixed items. Okay. That could be interesting. And I think, again, we're going to go blade ward. That could be good. We can give ourselves some resistances to stuff. And then our eldritch blast. Uh, we've got another scroll down here. And then down here, we've got... Tasha's Hideous Laughter, Dissonant Whispers, Hex, and this is going to be... I can't wear armor. That's fine. I can take armor off here in a second. This armor is what? So if I take that off, what does that do to my AC? It goes to 11, but I don't have any clothes. <laughs> so I can run around naked and cast... Mage, or in cast Mage Scroll. It's funny because I found robes last time when I was running through. So we'll have to look for some robes. But I'm going to put that up here because that's an ability. That's not a... We can cast that all we want. So I'm going to put it up here out of there. And I think that will be okay. And then I'm going to hit F5 again. Because I think after all that, we deserve another save. And as soon as we find some robes, we'll... Uh, can we get up here? We get to that. Yes. The answer is yes. We can climb up there. Yeah, it's 71 hit points. Potion of speed. Spiked bulb. And basic poison. Oh, okay. Well, I'm not... I mean, either of these characters could do that, but I, I'm not sure that that's the, the best option of that. What, what is it? Uh, not only tank. It's too heavy. All right, that's fine. Couple chests. Uh, I think th those are lock picks. That's why it's giving us a uh, spellcaster. Is going to use prepared, prepared spells. Change which spells you prepare anytime outside of combat. Moving and stacking objects so we can move objects around. And like I said, we could use psychic abilities or whatever to do that as well. And uh, lock picks. Uh, does she have sleight of hand by chance? Um, do we have sleight of hand? Oh, whoops, that's not what I want. Ouch, I crouched or something. A N. I think N is what I'm looking for. Um, tags, where are abilities? Sleight of hand. Okay, so she's got plus one. Do we have it? We also have plus one. Is it something we can use untrained? I assume so, because it's giving us the option here. We can either use it untrained or we have it. I don't remember if I... Yeah, so these... Well, no, it's just because I don't have a bonus to them, probably. Hmm. I do well with those. Persuasion and Deception are my two best ones. Okay, well, I'll hang on to it. I mean, it doesn't appear that it matters which of us has it. As far as the lockpicks go, let's find out now. Lockpick. I don't know if we waste lockpicks or if lockpicks break. Um, a hat. We'll give it to her. Um, hi. Let's give her the hat, and she can then wear the hat. And thieves' tools I'll hang on to. The rapier doesn't matter. Potion of speed. I will give her the potion of speed for now. 
Um, I don't know. Probably a lot of this we don't need. Mysterious liquid is dried to the... We'll let her just carry it. Um, we've got weight we can carry. She can carry a lot more than us. So I'm going to give her some food, too. Um, we'll give her a wheel of cheese and some bread. There we go. Something like that. Something like that. Really like the, the terrain. I think they did a really good job with it. Oh, there's somebody. Come here. Hurry. I've got one of those brain things cornered. There. Oh, I'm not supposed to have on the hat. She is. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? I have to fix that. Um. I don't know. Kill yourself. You look capable enough. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not to worry. Um, I don't have a... I guess my dex is better than my strength. Let's try this one. I love this. I love the dice. I love seeing what it is. I love seeing what the target is. I don't care if you win or lose. I just... This visibility into what happens is awesome. Not a word. Let's try to keep that lovely neck of yours in one piece. Hmm? That's got to hurt hanging onto the blade like that. I saw you on the ship, didn't I? Of course, I have the cleric there that could just kick him in the head now. Oh, I could headbutt him. I'll just nod. Splendid. And now you're going to tell me exactly what you and those tentacle freaks did to me. Ah, uh, they took me prisoner just like you. I... Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm, the light, the fear. Uh, what was that? What's going on? We're good with persuasion. Now we can whisper a cantrip to burn his hand. Um, I think we just do persuasion. Let's see if we can do the roll here. We only need a five. Just because we can. We just saw that we're good at it. We're going to use it. Yeah. Yeah, we definitely have to switch hats. That's... I'm not the one that's supposed to be getting hit. You... Not one of them. They took you. Just the same as me. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground I'm, with your innards. I'm guessing between the pictures they yeah, show on the loading things. screens and the pointy teeth there that he's a, he's, he might be a vampire. That's my guess. Um, I don't know that for sure. Uh, Everybody is pretty shady, as far as I can tell. All right, we got a clerk of deception. Um, it shows a, a warlock in there on the picture. Obviously, we got the Githyanki, and she's pretty cold-blooded, although she might be the good guy of the bunch. And uh, he's clearly sketchy. Um, glad we're all caught up now, I think is what we're going with. Please, allow me to introduce myself. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Uh, we're also Baldarian. Is that so? We clearly move in different circles. Did he just so, wink at him? Do you know anything about these worms? Nope. Well, yeah. But Listen to... <laughs> clearly more than he does. <laughs> of course it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? I think the irony is we're already all... We're all monsters already. It hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. Uh, odds are better together. You know, I was ready to go this alone. You and me, maybe me and you. 
Da -da -da -da. And you seem like a useful person to know. That's it. I don't want it. My singing's so good, it will definitely trigger a copyright strike. Lead on. All right. Let's go ahead and take a look at him. He gets a level up, too. That's a perfect time to take a look at him. High Elf Rogue. Um, doesn't say Vampire anywhere in there, so I could be wrong. Um, he gets Dash, uh, and that's about it. So we're going to hit say OK. And now I'm going to go into inventory. No, I'm going to go into character sheets, right? Character panels. That's what I want. All right, let's give her the helm. Uh, she's got something. Let's give it to him. Yeah, he looks dashing with it, but we don't want to cover up our beautiful hair. We might have to start, like I said, we might have to just start running around naked. Um, that looks kind of bad. I'll just, just say. Um, oh, you know what I meant to do? Hold on. I meant to come back over here. I think it's going to take us to the same place. But I'm going to come in this way. Because the last time I went in the other way. Oh, we got people up there. Wait. Do we see people up here? It gave us a yellow diamond up there for a second. Uh, what do we have there? Mind Flare. Dead Mind Flare. Let's go check this one before we worry about the live one. Where is he? Potion of Speed. Okay. I think we'll go ahead and hand that off as well. We gave her one. Let's give one to him. Um, and we may as well give the rest of the, these to him as well. Because he's more likely to need them. And we'll give him the trap disarm as well. I'm assuming his sleight of hands is going to be better than ours. And we'll give him the love letter. Oh, and a rapier. Can, uh... So now if we go here, and then we go... What does he have? He has a that. Can you use this? All right, so it's 1d8. Finesse still. So let's give him that. Yeah, there we go. Hopefully we avoid the fire there. More survivors? They're trying to dig somebody out of the wreckage. Something's wrong. They should be so trying to get away blood. if they had any sense. Come on, dig! Faster! Get her out of there! Don't die! Don't die! Don't die! The person they're trying to save, it's the creature from the ship. Still alive, but wounded. This is the one check I missed last time. This persuasion right here. It's clouding your minds. Look what's in front of you. It's only a 10. Yeah, we made it this time. Your voice cuts through the fog of confusion. You can see the creature's hold on them wavering. As its influence wanes, they clutch their heads, blinking in confusion. Where... where are we? There was... fire in the sky and... and then... the voice... Oh God, the voice! What happened? Uh, the monster. Oh, the voice. What was it saying? It was... calling for help. God's above, it sounded just like my daughter. But... she's been dead for years. That thing got into our heads, drove us mad. We wrecked our boat, just trying to get close to it. What do we do now? Uh, where are we? We're nowhere. That's the point. Even with a boat, Baldur's Gate is days. Wait. You. I was lucky. We ended up back on a plane with Baldur's Gate. Just like one of those things. You're one of them. I mean, all things considered, I mean, we just went through like six planes of existence and we ended up back where we started. That's pretty good. 
Um, they abducted me, but I escaped. Probably should have gone show some gratitude, right? After all, I am the the haughty noble. Those people. The mind flare made them its puppets. You approach the dying monster. This is the thing that abducted you. You could end its life here and now. If only you didn't feel compassion. Compassion? No, you should be furious. Yes, you feel hate. And you deserve to be punished. Oh. For it. You should be whipped, made to bow before this creature in shame. He turned that around on us. It's possessing your mind, forcing you to love it. But then the feeling slips. The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. Uh, let's concentrate on its thoughts. We get a roll. Need an eight. Oh, we missed it. It's okay. You try to break through, but its mind is impenetrable. With a last surge of defiance, I made it last time. Efforts away. The monster lies exhausted, defeated. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Close those eyes forever. Yeah, you can't, you can't risk him hanging around, finding some other sucker that, uh, you know what I want to do? I want to give some of these things to him to throw, right? So we've got like an alchemist fire, um, and maybe one of these spiked bulbs. Let's give him that. Seems to me the, the rogue is a good person to have some of that stuff. Uh... Oh, we've got goblins here. Little axe. A hall of scimitar. These appear to be random. Um, I found a bow last time and an axe, but I don't think I found a scimitar. And I don't remember if it's just because I didn't see it and didn't click it, or if it's just it was different. So I don't think we really have anybody that needs the scimitar. We don't have a proficiency in it. Um, she's got a weapon of some sort already. We could use the hand axe. Uh, we're using a dagger right now. So it'll be slashing instead of piercing. Yeah, I think we do that. Let's go ahead and equip that. Um, the bow is the same as the bow we have, I believe. Oh, we don't have a bow. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know that we'll ever use it. Does he have a bow? Probably. No, he doesn't. All right, let's give him the bow. Never hurts to have an extra ranged ability, right? Um, yeah, I think we go with that. Oh, I'm going to do an F5. Sorry about that. Alive. That's unexpected. Last I saw you, you were lying in a crucible's worth of blood. An intellect devourer nibbling at your ear. Glad to see my eyes deceive me. I'm Gale. Well met. Uh, you were on the ship as well. You don't trust him. Draw your weapon. Very same. A traumatizing experience, if an instructive one. I don't trust any of them. Um... By trauma, I suppose you mean the thing they put in my eye. Yes. The ocular penetration by an elithid tab pole, which will end with our souls being snuffed like strands of weave caught in dead magic. Yep. Not to mention, you're staring at me like a rashimi at a blackboard. You're no wizard, are you? I'm better than a wizard. I'm a warlock. There's a gust of weave about you, but it's a mere breeze. I need a tempest. It'll have to wait. The primary need is a healer. I take it you recall the insertion of the parasite? 
<laughs> vividly. Are you aware that after a period of excruciating gestation, it'll turn us into mind flayers? Yep. A process known as seramorphosis? It is to be avoided. <laughs> I assume you're no accomplished healer either. Powerful cleric, maybe? You know, the thing is, he's a sarcastic asshole, but he might be the closest thing to a good guy we've seen so far. Um, yeah, can't say that I am. Why can't you just use magic? After all, you're this crazy Sadly, wizard. My studies of the arcane are on hold for the foreseeable future. This is beyond me. For now. For now. You and I are in a whole lot of trouble. We need help, and I'm not sure where we'll find it in this wilderness. How about we embark on the quest for a healer together? Together. All right. Most excellent. Then, without further ado, let's be off. Besides, looks like you keep some interesting company. A woman with shadows for eyes. Deep as the dark lake. Pleasure, madam. Is it indeed? We'll see. All right. Let's go ahead and take a look at him. He also gets a level. He is human wizard, evocation. Uh, we've got a ray of sickness and feather fall. Prepared spells, five out of five. Um, grease, thunder wave. Okay. Uh, sleep, witch bolt, and fog cloud. Right, sure, that sounds good. Um, oh, this will change the spells we get. We could get jump and protection from now. Nah, we'll go evocation. That's cool. I'm good with that. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at how we got him set up real fast. Whoops, no, not not that. I need N, I think. Um, so he's got one arcane recovery, once per day, replenish expended spell slots, which allow you to cast spells. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and again, we'll give ourselves a couple extra pluses. I'm gonna put the healing potion down here and I'm gonna slide that down there as well. Uh, and then we've got cantrips. We've got Firebolt, Mage Hand, and Ray of Frost. Uh, manipulate objects. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and toss our spells down here. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. That looks good. And we don't have those. Oh, we might get Ray um, 2d8 poison. That's pretty good. I might want that. Sleep is always good. Grease. Hmm. Let's undo that one and throw that one up there. And call it a day. Is it going to let us do it? I guess so. Okay, and a quick F5 because we got a new guy in the party. And let's switch back to here. And see what we see. Uh, I don't see anything back there. Is this... Is this where those people were a second ago? I thought I remembered seeing like a door down there when they showed our, uh... Oh. What's that? Hmm. I betcha that's something we could drop somehow. Let's see, where is it tied to? Hmm, I guess just that. I don't know. I do not know. All right, well, let's... Anyway, yeah, this looks like where those people were standing. Um, the troll and the... The drought, what did I just do? I just made a saving throw. Oh, for these, I think. Yeah. For the, this, uh, the vines, I think, is what we're making saving throws for. 10 XP for something. 